At last you're in me power, me proud beauty. Marry me. Never. What? You refuse me? Marry me or I'll tear you limb from pieces. I'd rather die in prison to fertilizer. Use a vapor. What? I can't control me blood pressure. Bring on the wood and make a fire. Curses. <laughs> Tis I, Julius. Fear not. I'll grab the rat. My hero. Shh. Why? Which? Where? When? I see nothing but wind. <laughs> What's this, a tree? Why, no. No, it's our hero. Marry me, girl, and take a load off your feet. Curses, you still refuse me? My oriental blood is boiling. I thirst for revenge. Where's me matches? Give me a match. Give me a match before I go mad. Try this blowtorch, fixed eye peak. <laughs> me wrath is subdued. Curses, it won't work. Me wrath is aroused. I could strangle a grape. Stop! Julius speaking. Curses! Bring me my smelling salts. Don't overheat my Roman blood. Hold still, so I can shoot you. Ah, the gun's got the dropsy. <laughs> oh, I'm ruined. Seize him, men! Stop, or my Bowie knife will cut you. Curses! Oh, good gracious. <laughs> the rats have eaten the handle off. Tear him to pieces, men, but save the hat. Pigsty Pete, stop. You forget I am a ball player. <laughs> Strike one and four yards to go, folks. My little sugar plum, Julius, your heavy date has saved you. My hero. One pull and you are free. Crash into my arms and kiss me, my sweetheart, my angel, my darling, darling. What the man? <laughs> my sweetheart, my angel, darling. And like the wind, they skipped as two fairies, then rode towards the setting sun and the western skies, which they loved. This stuff is terrible, son. Simply terrible. I'm surprised that you're writing such worthless trash. Not so worthless, Dad. That book has sold 50,000 copies up to date. The public eat it up. They love it. It makes no difference. The way you write makes people think that our West is a heck-raising, rip-snorting wilderness. Well, it may have been in the days of 49, but your stuff should be up to date. <laughs> Don't let it get you, Dad. It's all in fun. I'm selling what I'm writing, and I'm making money. My public get a big kick out of it. Well, just the same, it's all wrong. Any real Westerner would laugh at stuff like this. Wait a minute, Dad. Where's that letter, Percy? Here's a real Westerner who doesn't agree with you. Read it. Dear Mr. Morris, I am an admirer of your books, but I think you really do not know the West. If you will come to my mystery ranch, I could show you real he-men who will make the cowboys, sheriffs, and posses in your novels look like sissies. Please accept my invitation as a guest at Mystery Ranch and learn about the real West. Sincerely yours, Mrs. J.H. Henderson. Well, that woman's plumb crazy. Anyone who thinks your stuff is tame must be nuts. What do you think of it, Percy? Do you think she's spoofing me? Of course. If she implies that Western life on a ranch is wilder than in your novels, I should say she'd have to, to go some. <laughs>